just a ton of really good Half-Life mods out there. I'm gonna say, I mean, Ooh. it's just, it's just such a solid base. Okay, you literally can't walk across that, I see. Um, it's such a solid base they, idea. Ooh, hello. Secret. Nope. Nope. Not really yeah. secret. The areas are connected by maintenance access that you can uh, use to sort of backtrack and create an easy way to get through the levels if you missed something. <gasps> but yeah, I, I'm going to say, like, the, the games, uh, the idea behind the game, the premise, is just such a strong premise that... I, I can see why a lot of people like Monogate. And like you said as well, it was one of the games that kind of made the first-person shooter a sort of first-person story game in in like into what it is today. So I can imagine that's another big reason why it's a highly modded game. Yeah, exactly. Um, but one of the most famous mods is a mod it's not even really a mod at this point. It's it's more its own game in the Half-Life 2 engine, the Source engine, that completely remakes Half-Life Half -Life 1 uh, from the ground up, basically. Oh, nice. Don't worry, there's water at the bottom. I was right this time. Yeah, you was. I just have to say that every time, and I'll be right one of these days. <laughs> A lot going on yeah, right so now. This is this is the sewage uh, plant where we torch the sewage with fire and send it through giant gears. It makes the poop nice and crispy. Crispy poop. Crispy poop. But the the mod is called Black Mesa. Yeah, yeah, I know Black Mesa. And. Again, someone, when I suggested that we play Half-Life, said, you know, someone said, you know, you could blah blah blah, uh, play Black Mesa instead. Uh, I still think that we're doing the right thing by playing the original first, because like Half-Life 2, you can't really appreciate Black Mesa to its fullest unless you've played the original. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so this is another one of those backtracking zones. Those maintenance doors allow you to go backwards. Where the fuck am I going, so so this is that room you were in, that you fell down into, and that maintenance door allows you to go back. This is just a sort of side area to get some HP. Uh, th that hole in the floor you swam up through? Well, we could go through the whole thing again, why not? You know, back through the sewage plant. Tally-ho! <laughs> Don't worry. Just... <laughs> It's difficult trying to guide you when with every step you go the wrong direction. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that side area uh, was just a side area with supplies in it. You were meant to keep swimming this way. I see. Right, okay. Let's use this. I would actually need to. Okay. Uh, then we'll stop this. I think it's stop the conveyor belts or something. I'm not sure. It didn't stop the conveyors, but it did stop the uh, thing. And yeah, that's another backtracking door in case you needed to use the health machine. <laughs> I see it. Yeah, I see it. Oh. I'm not sure what you I'm set them all to go back. You set them all to go backwards by pulling the levers. Mm. This thing can swim. That's news. It's literally a bull squid. Nah. Ah, fake news. It might help to make the uh, conveyors go forwards. And then press the button to turn off the things again. Because I believe it only stops them for a certain amount of time. I see. Whee, away we go. Yeah. Okay. That works. And Black Mesa, like, you've said a lot of things in this. Like, it's a good game, but it is rough around the edges because yeah. it was basically just guessing. <laughs> um, that ladder's just there for if you fall off. I was just trying to take the secret. And Black Mesa has years of uh, experience. Like to, a lot of different you know, mod is working on this sort of thing. 
Am I yeah. going this? No, I don't know what you're doing. You have to jump down onto this conveyor, yeah. And this area is just sort of jumping from conveyor to conveyor. Yeah, it has years of experience and, you know, years of knowing how to actually properly game design, which I, I love Valve, I love Half-Life, but with the original, they, they really didn't know what they were doing. I'm getting very confused now. Don't worry, you're on the right path. That's not the right path. That's, <laughs> that's broken ankles. <laughs> Shit. Crouching helps when fighting things close to the ground. I'm just gonna let this kill me and uh, respawn my checkpoint, or I'm just gonna press F7. See, you're learning. How the fuck did you survive I that? I do not know. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't survive that one there. Crunch. Um, but yeah, they, they've done a lot of things like refining, it's a lot clearer in Black Mesa where you're supposed to go and what does what. There's more like consistency on how certain doors open. Yeah. Um, and they also did the, had the genius idea to basically completely remove on a rail. Oh, really? <laughs> uh, yeah, the chapter's still there, but all that like winding pathways and shit is just completely gone. They, uh... You just recycled yourself back through the area. Fuck! <laughs> just go back around the normal way. It's no. gonna be more painful to crawl backwards. <laughs> yeah, this, it's gonna be so much more painful. Yeah, so but they, they didn't remove on a rail per se, but they, they made it actually live up to its name of being on a rail. Which bit do I go on here? I think it doesn't matter, but there's a, a, a mine in there, so... Excuse me? No! No! I believe you can use satchel charges here. I don't like have if any. You would send a... Oh, there was some back on the table in that room. I thought you picked them up. Not did I, to be honest. Ah, uh, never mind. There'll be more in your future. You won't be a, a sad, satchel chargeless boy for long. Ah. Ah. Jim? Why'd you do that to me? Oh, that's just that room, I guess. Yeah. A lot of the maintenance corridors interconnect again to help you sort of you move around, go back and forth. Okay, there you go. I'm through this time. Oh my god. Head crab is just chilling. He doesn't he's not gonna get crushed. Oh no, okay, he is. Head I'm guessing I've got a dodge. Dead. I'm guessing I've got a dodge when it munches. Yes, you're somehow going to time it perfectly though. Yeah. Yes! Okay. We're moving along. We're making good progress here. Good progress yep. indeed. You're going at a steady pace. Questionable ethics. Oh, this is a good chapter. Uh, I'm guessing I've got to just, like, get out of the fuck out of here because I don't have any ammo. That noise is just beautiful. <laughs> Love it. They're pretty puppies, aren't they? So, standing still for a second, <laughs> that was a kennel full of alien dogs. Like, <laughs> in an actual kennel. That's amazing. So what does that yeah. tell you? Does it mean that they've taken over the regular dogs? No. Or does that mean there's going to be a lot of regular dogs around? Oh, hello. That's a big penis. Oh, no, it's an arm. Oh, hello. This is um, where you start to realise that things are not quite as they seem. Hello. Yeah, I gotta say, I'm guessing this is where we're realising. Ah, I see. You see, I see what you mean now. So these were here prior to the breakout, prior to the 
yes. invasion, as was this guy. Black Mace has been poking their nose where it doesn't belong for a while now. Those are... Uh, shoot these tiny... They basically shoot little bees. Um, little alien bees that don't do a lot of damage, but will hunt you down and kill you. <laughs> no matter the cost. There's also... Okay. Uh, yeah. So... Am I meant to press that button or not? You could try it, I don't know. Oh, no, I already pressed it. Cool, I'm through. Okay. Yeah. Aha! It's like an incubation center for head crabs. Okay, so this is where we're seeing, like, what. what like, this incident wasn't as unprecedented as, as previously thought. Yep. Black Mace has been sticking its nose where it doesn't, didn't belong for a while now, and it will happen behind the scenes, but something like this massive resonance cascade is bound to happen eventually. Nice. Cheeky boys. Oh, fuck me. It's Marines moving in on the room. And there's also the alien soldier. So I'm However, just there here. <laughs> well, that button isn't out of commission. I see. Wait, I, I think just... you actually might have cr crushed him with the door. <laughs> I'm yes, I let him through. When those doors shut, anything in the room with uh, anything in the room outside of that control chamber is fucked. Nice. So you can actually use that to finish off Marines and the alien. Just don't let him get in the control chamber. But he can still oh. shoot through it, though. Fuck is shooting you through the walls! <laughs> nice. Fucking cheeky bastard. <laughs> Wall hacks. I think it's because you closed the door at exactly I the did, right time. Yeah. Where he couldn't get in, but he could stick his arm through. I closed it, like, on him, but it didn't quite kill him or, like, get him in the room. It's just like... Hey, it's no good up there. It's all sealed off. The only way out would be to find someone with scanner access who can open the front door. I'm pretty sure there's a few scientists hiding somewhere in the labs. Maybe with both of us looking, we can track them down and get them to let us out. Sounds good, dude. Let's go. Okay, we might live longer if we work together. I mean, you did just suggest that. It's kind of weird that you'd say that. Okay. Oh no. That's a lot of enemies. The fuck am I meant to do with this much ammo? Well, killing them will give you more because they're carrying weapons. Oh wait, did this dude just fucking kill them all? Oh no, okay. He killed a couple. And also you can pick up his pistol. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Living the high life now. Got weapons and shit. Yeah, so, like he said, you're looking for scientists with scanner access. Okay. We can keep it moving. Yep. Yeah, that's the scanner, I'm guessing. The audio is really weird in here. It's like only coming out of one earphone. I don't think that's my headset doing that. I mean, I'm hearing it just fine, but maybe that's Discord fixing it. It's gone very strange. This is another one of these rooms, I see. Yeah, it's a different one. And I'm guessing... I'll do this. There's something waiting for you at the end of that corner. Yeah, I just noticed that. Is that a weapon or another alien? Why must there be a difference? It's an alien I can use as a weapon, isn't it? 
awesome. Meet Snarks. <laughs> they are very... They're, they're basically little chitinous balls of rage. So it's like a grenade. Uh, it is basically a biological grenade. You throw them and they will run around biting anything that moves before exploding. But that uh, enemies will shoot at them because they can still die. But if you have a large amount of snarks, you can essentially flood an area with them and have them deal with it. Sounds like a plan. However, the one downside is that they will also attack you because they don't have loyalty. They just ah. want to kill everything. Even though I can pick it up and hold it in my hands perfectly fine. Well, you know, there are ways to handle a crab where it can't pitch you. I don't want to throw one into the mine and see what happens. There's the charges. Okay. Yep, you can use trip mines now too. The hell am I going here? I believe you want to set off those. Last doors are closing. Uh, Last doors uh, are closing. Uh, um, 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 oh, no, they're not. Yeah. Oh, did you just die so quick, though? They die so easily. Yeah. Like I said, it's it's best to flood an area with them. Like, save all, all of your snarks and then just spam them. You know? Yeah. Because they can't kill all of them. Three shotgun shots for you? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. He's coming, isn't he? Yep, yeah, Santa's on his way! <laughs> Somewhat good here. Oh shit. <laughs> For some reason I wasn't expecting that. Even though that was very obviously gonna happen. Yeah, head crabs are very good at breaking glass. Just don't interrupt them. Yeah. Enemies will fight, of course, among themselves if you don't interrupt them. The hell have I done here? Have I activated the powers unintentionally there? I think I have. It's a prototype. Oh, I hear a boy. Excuse me. It's much too unpredictable. Don't let it overcharge. What do you mean overcharge? Okay, let's start, I think. What do you mean overcharge? <laughs> so this confused. is a laser this is a laser testing room. That thing in the middle of the room is a big ol' fuck-off laser, and it needs smaller lasers to power it. Okay. So I got one laser. If you look at the ceiling, you can yeah. follow its path. It seems to stop like... Oh no, okay, I see it. It goes over here. And it and wants this. another laser to combine with itself. And then it go here and do another laser, I see. Probably good to use it in here now? No, we you need it. four lasers. Four? Oh, it's That's why there's four corridors. Yes, but remember when we talked about outside last time? Yeah. Well, you'll be able to go outside soon. You'll be able to touch grass. Hmm, I'm scary. Right. So yes, these boys were talking about a weapon that they oh, shouldn't let yes. overcharge. And then someone overcharged it. This is the Tau Cannon. I must say I've seen this thing before, this thing's wrong. You can, f you can spam it, or you can hold to charge it, I believe. Uh, I think it's right click to charge it. Yeah. But if you hold it too long, it explodes. I see. <laughs> yeah. I see. So, you can charge it up, 
for that risky maneuver. A laser shield is preventing it from causing any damage. I want it to cause damage, though. How do I stop the shield? Maybe looking at the safety warnings would be good for once. Do not obstruct laser shield. That's why I just like to stand here. <laughs> oh, God, I, I like the I like the cut of your jib. I, I like your hounds. gumption, kid. I don't know what I last saved. I think it was just before this room here. It, it was a good theory. It was a good theory, yes. I'm guessing there's a box that I can put in the way of it or something. Yeah, there is. I like how if you obstruct it, it doesn't even try, it just gives <laughs> yeah, up. It's just like, nah. And that laser activated the wall's secret stash of TNT. Let's there are go. pipes you can clamber down to, you know, not take full damage. Oh, I see. Okay. We're on the escape. A scientist. Thank me. Oh, what? Get us out of here before those military kids will go to be your own. Yeah, I don't... Mm. We all have regular scanner they're both dead. Okay, so we grab this. Yeah. God damn. So, they were just talking about how one of the uh, other scientists who was with them switched that thing on to protect them, but he it killed him. That's why it was covered in red. Right. Yeah. You, you, You'll you also need them to follow you. Okay, come on, boys. We did leave a big guy over here. I hope he's gone. Well, you have the Tau Cannon, which can easily dispatch them with a charge shot. Oh, okay. This way, fellas, I think. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. This way. I don't remember where I'm going. This way, maybe. Where's the other dude? I think it's... Ah, he probably got stuck on some corner. You don't need both of them. You just need one of them to make it. Fair enough. Yeah, I think this is the way. Okay, I think, I think we're in the right way now. Come on, dude, hurry up! Like you've never seen an alien invasion before, hurry! Glad to oblige a fellow scientist. God damn! Y'all useless. Glad to oblige a fellow scientist. Do it. Well, I'll let you know, but I'm warning you, it's hell out there. It's completely under We're revolving door. Save. Yep. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah. The uh, the military used grenades to lure you out of cover, so they registered that you were behind cover, so they decided to go for the grenade technique. Okay, I'm gonna you should be able to get out of there by just. This. Yep. Okay, this thing is right. Yeah, and that's just the rapid fire. The charge shot is much stronger. Okay. Good, good, good. Right. More XP! Did that feel good? Good, good. This game has a real inconsistency of whether doors need buttons or not. So yes, now you're topside. <laughs> hey, um, buddy! <laughs> that was confusing. He just wanted a hug. Ah, uh, you're out of ammo. The, the Tau Cannon uses these, uh, like, they basically look like lunch boxes with yellow lids as ammo. So keep okay. an eye out for them. Oh boy, the dam. Oh 
slow down. What was that? That wasn't very accurate. What are you firing up there for, you twat? This, the helicopter will fire on you if it sees you, so you have to dash across when its back is turned. This isn't going to go well. <laughs> I can tell you well, that at now. Least, at least you know what's happening now. I do. I'm not really not sure what was up with the crossbow before. It's usually much more accurate than that. Probably some weird um, quirk. Yeah. What I said about waiting uh, for the helicopter to... Yeah. Do you remember? Because I don't think you remember. I said wait for it to turn around. It's turned around. I don't know how to do this. I don't understand. What am I doing wrong? Well, you can't actually open those uh, blast doors at the end. You need to go into the water. That's not the water. The water. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, turtle. There's water at the bottom. <laughs> but you're uh, you're not alone. Oh yeah, the bolts move slower underwater. There's a door. Okay, I see. I see. I'm understanding it all now. Okay, I press this button, what happened? Something opened up underneath the dam. So if you jump back into the water... Oh, you killed it! Or the military killed it or something. Do I need to be doing this? I don't know. Uh, those grates beside the thing, beside the valve, are opening as you turn it. Um, okay. I can see clearly now. This is why I'm here. <laughs> so yeah, that button turned off those turbines, which would have killed you otherwise. Okay. Helicopter's still going to be a problem? Yep. <laughs> I don't believe it can see you underwater, so... I gotta say, yeah, I mean, how, who could see through this? It's just like... Yeah! The, the Black Mesa Sewage Canyon. It's textures. Right, keep going. We are doing quite well, quite well. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that was overkill, but I had to try. Drastically overkill. Yeah, big helicopter is big scary. Mm -hmm. The military are really going overboard with this one. So, I'm one. My, my sort of thought at the minute, my my main sort of thing that I'm thinking is, did the military know about the experiments before it all went wrong, or is that something that? that was if I recall, ground? like. I'm not 100% sure on this, but if I if I recall correctly, Black Mesa did have uh, military contracts as funding. So the military um, probably knew about it to the extent that it benefited them. I don't know where I'm going but Black right Mesa now. is ultimately a private company. Oh. Yeah. I saw that in the okay. Just shooting him in the back with your pea shooter as he tries to run away. Yeah, I'm so fucked. <laughs> yeah, so again, I'm not 100% sure on that, but I'm fairly certain I'm correct in saying so. Yeah. Me? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I kind of thought that was going to happen. Yeah, headcrabs not only uh, hide in vents, but they can also burrow. Ah, that was a mine. I see. Yeah, uh, maybe read the signs. I, I, just, I, said, I saw that it said mine, I just didn't know where they were. You can't see the mines, but you can set them off with bullets. Helicopter, could you like chill for this 
Merman, please. I believe you can also set the mines off with snarks. Ah, oh, that's a good idea, yeah. Fucking leave me be, you stupid bitch. There was a hatch. A hatch, where? Uh, I believe if you go back, uh, where you that, came that... to get to this tent. Yeah, I, I, I see what you're getting in there, yeah. Let's go here. Don't you seem to do anything. Oh, you might have needed to open it somehow. I... I'll be honest, I'm not very... I'm not a clever man. I just say what I say and hope it works. So that helicopter is your arch nemesis for the time being. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hello. Another one of these fuckers. Yeah. So you don't need to go into that <laughs> thing. The helicopter went through the skybox. <laughs> Listen, it's milit no, it's military cloaking technology. <laughs> That's too. fucking great. It's military cloaking. So you don't need to engage with that tentacle, but it's got supplies around it if you want to try and distract it. Including more snarks. That's what I was just thinking, yeah. So I've been here before. This, I was already here. Yeah. There's a lot of ways to crawl through the rocks in this area. I don't have any grenades. I can't really set it Your off. Your gun grenades can distract it. Oh, I can, can I? Yeah. Wait, wait. All the supplies are gone. Hmm. Really not sure why that would happen. Uh, try going back the first way. Maybe they unloaded or some weird quirk of the game being made with, like, sticks and chewing gum. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Or maybe the military nuked it. Fucking! Listen to the grenade, you bitch. You know you like it, you saucy bugger. Listen to your heart, listen to the beat, listen to the rhythm, the rhythm of the street. Open up your eyes, open up your ears, get together and make things better by working together. Arthur. I don't, oh, I don't yeah. even know if those are the lyrics. It's about right. About right. right. You know what? Where am I going now? Maybe save, so you don't have to do that. Oh god, I saved as the helicopter started shooting me, that was not good. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Oh, no. Hitcrib. It's okay, it just means you need to be a bit careful. Uh, there is something around here. I was already here, wasn't I? Maybe try retracing your steps. Yeah, you've been here before. This is the area you climbed Fuck. up through. So instead of... Yeah, duck out of the way. Pedal, you can avoid those bullets. You've done it once. <laughs> Fuck me. Yeah, maybe save when he's not actively shooting at you. Okay, uh, I think now? this is another way forwards. Oh, I know that. Yeah, this is the minefield you were in earlier. There might be a valve around here or something to open up the. Uh... It's a big old pain in the ass. What is this? You know what? How about you try smacking it with your crowbar? Oh, I thought to say it. Yeah. <laughs> no. I wasn't doing anything. Okay, I was going to laugh very hard if that, if that was the solution. Oh my god, what the fuck? Again. Old game direction isn't really the best. Listen, it was it was the 1990s. They didn't know how gravity worked back then. Einstein Newton had not even been born. Einstein Newton. Yeah, I have no idea where I'm going whatsoever. I have literally no idea what I'm doing right now. Uh, let me look into it again. Do -do -do -do. Surface tension. I just keep dying. 
Yeah, I'm just looking into it for you. You want to go towards a uh, tower. A tower? I haven't even seen a tower. Uh, try crawling around until you see... The, the guide I've found is very descriptive. It just tells you go between some rocks, which is all you've been fucking doing. <laughs> A fucking tower? Where? Uh... Just snoop around. Oh, here, here, here. Ah! Uh, there's gonna be a way into that tower somewhere. I can't remember where the tower was anymore. <laughs> this is why we save. Yeah. Save here. Now, uh, yeah, that tower over there. Three HP. There's Marines. I have three HP. I you also have a crossbow. But the enemies don't spawn until I get close to them, though. I think they're hiding behind rocks. Yeah, it's not that they haven't spawned in, it's that they're taking cover. My god, this crossbow sucks fucking butts. It never shoots where you actually aim. Man, I... Gotta admit, I... I re Like, it's, it's just a trope of old games, but I really despise this thing of having to manual save and then it putting you back at, like, 3 HP each time. It's just, like... You accidentally make a mistake ages ago, and it's like, oh, well, there you go, you fucked for the rest of the game now. Uh, yeah, try just sneaking around and trying, and, yeah, get them before they notice you. Mm. That was the other way around. I'm not using the crossbow, the crossbow fucking sucks. You can try the magnum. Oh, I didn't have enough ammo in it! Reload it, you stupid bitch! Oh my god, I'm getting so frustrated. It's really Fortunately, I, uh, I do believe there are med kits nearby. Yeah, you can uh, shelter in the tower, maybe save again. Yeah, my guy didn't really seem to give two fucking flying shits. Yeah, you didn't hit him head on with the uh, shotgun, so he didn't really care. If it's any consolation, they're just as bad as the with the grenades as you are. Yeah, they are. How did that not hit you? You slimy piece of shit. Half of it hit the door. Die! You stupid. You have, you have grenades on your uh, on your machine gun. It's not sniping. I don't know if you know that. Okay, so that's the hatch. Yeah, and I believe there are supplies in that little tent. I've already got the tent supplies, I'm pretty sure I got them earlier. Uh, I think there's more hidden behind. Thank you. If you get past that thing. Fuck off, helicopter. helicopter. I can't be <laughs> arsed with your fucking... Mm. Oh, this is... Fucking horrible! I fucking hate it's okay. this. It's okay. You'll be able to get your revenge soon. You'll be able to get your revenge soon. Fucking don't you dare hit me, you stupid coward! I thought you were just gonna say stupid ha cow. <laughs> stupid cow. Okay, that's how you get in. See, I actually forgot that because I've always done it in the opposite order. Like, I've always already done the thing before I reach the... Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, you've already opened the, the hatch before you get to it. Yeah, so that's why it confused me so much when it wasn't open. Anyways, yes, forwards progress. Just give me some fucking HP game, please. So, uh, how good are you with heights? This is 
High quality. Listen, okay. Don't be a dick. I'm not good with, with heights when I literally can't fall without breaking a single tour. This is gonna be a fucking nightmare. Fuck but this. The grenades have gravity, so aim higher if you want to try and use them. Oh no, this can fuck right off. This seems like absolute cancer. Fuck this. My god, this is going to be AIDS. Because the uh, geometry is sloped, you can use it to avoid fall damage by sliding down it. Why did you do that, what Freeman? That? You fucking retard. <laughs> Stop Freeman, doing that, fool. Freeman! Freeman, you absolute fucking smegma sponge. God damn, oh, this geez, is so frustrating. The mountain vomited. You can barely tell it's not real. <laughs> it's like I'm really there. Oh, you can fuck off as well, you lanky cunt. You're right, out I'm of out, grenades. Now I'm out of grenades. This is scary now. Yeah. You, your insta-kill weapons for marines would be the magnum and the crossbow. Yeah. Impulse I'm not sure shit. what killed you there, I'll be honest. I think it was him. Maybe we should have elected uh, for easy mode. Fucking crossbows need to travel a bit faster than that. You fucking... Oh my... God, this game. Where's the health? Give me some fucking health, you useless piece of shit. I think oh there my are rocks god. falling that have been killing you. Is it? Is that what it is? Oh my god, I finally got him, stupid cunt. Fuck you. What are you doing, Freeman, you spastic? Oh my god, I'm getting so frustrated at this piece of shit. Fre uh. Freeman doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. Freeman can oh, suck I, my... I do think that centre thing may contain health. No, it's just a block. I, I, sorry, misremembering. You... Why is this so, like... Oh my god! Oh. Hey, at least he died too. <laughs> it's just the reactions of these boys. <laughs> there you go. I just fucking shot him in the dirt. Oh god. Yeah, I think there's health in there. Oh my god, but somehow. And you have a rocket launcher. The rocket launcher is remote controlled, so well, that little well, where red the hell dot. The go? Oh, it's flying around somewhere. I think it just blew the up. Rocket, the rocket launcher is a way to handle the helicopter and other helicopters you come across. A few, a few rockets and they go down. Or it, I think. Don't shoot that with the rocket launcher. Alternatively, do it may work better. <laughs> Wait a second. Wait a minute. <laughs> this boy is defying gravity. <laughs> yeah, that happens. Uh, so now what are you going to do about this? I'm <laughs> impressed. I don't your know how own, I did that. <laughs> your own minds can still hurt you, so that wasn't like some friend, not no friendly fire stuff. That was just... I don't some know if you were like issue or slightly yeah. in the geometry enough to where it didn't like cause an issue. That was pretty impressive, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, this game. So, this area. It's all about going underground through the tunnels and popping up where they don't expect it to fire on them. So basically, will... this is whack-a-mole for them. 
Yes, they will try and throw grenades at, uh, down your holes if you... That came out wrong. They will tr The geometry here is really fucky. You can't walk over this. It's very satisfying when you get, like, a jump perfect. Yeah. And yes. Half-Life 2 really improves on the geometry and stuff, doesn't it? Oh yeah, there's also a tank. Maybe oh, save. This is gonna be a save after every kill sort of area, isn't it? Yeah, the tank will... Uh, if you're anywhere in the vague area of forwards, it will initiate protocol fuck you, and the only way you can destroy it is with explosives. So you could actually slap a, uh, some trip wires on it. <laughs> yeah. Like, behind it, put a couple on, and then really set them off yourself. Like, with the pistol or something from a distance. Nope. <laughs> I, think it, I think it thinks you're hitting the tank. Oh, grenade. Okay, that what didn't... was that for? I don't know why I did that. I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, there's a lot of supplies there. Satchel charges and missiles for your grenade launcher. No, not your grenade launcher. Your missile launcher. It's the missile launcher that shoots missiles. You don't have a grenade launcher. You just have grenades. And little boys. What? Is it worth I think blowing this thing up? The trick. It makes stuff easier. And you have spare missiles just sitting there. So proud of you for getting used to saving. So now I'm used to it, it's not so bad. Man, yeah. Well. Half-Life is one of those games where, especially if you're getting into it and you're still not, like, you don't have a memory of what's going on, it's like, how the fuck was I supposed to know that? Yeah. Ooh, look at oh, yeah. that loading. Ooh. Tanks will, uh, and armored vehicles are becoming a thing. You can destroy them with rockets. <laughs> yeah. Boom. It takes a few to knock them down, but I think those, uh, those little dudes take fewer than tanks. Whoopsie. But they're also shooting back, so maybe don't stand in one place like a gormless idiot. Just an idea. You know, you don't have to take uh, criticism. Got him. Oh. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, nice. the Ordnance Storage Facility. There's a minefield surrounding it. And... Oh yeah, grenades are actually good at setting off mines. Okay, that kind of... <laughs> Maybe worked? I don't actually know what just happened there. Am I stuck? For interacting? Oh no, yeah, it just wanted you to open that door so it could load the second door. Oh, for fuck's sake. Can you stop loading the other zone, you shit game? So, things you hate. Loading zones. Don't stay in the fucking loading zone. Also, there's snipers in this area. So keep be on the lookout. They help will me. No. Please help me. I'm I'm dying out here. Please. I see a shotgun. Oh, this game makes me want to kill myself. 
makes you? I feel like that all the time. <laughs> Maybe don't. Yeah. Well, you did just skip a large portion. <laughs> you don't have to go this way now. Wait, but what? there is a sniper there that is fucking with Wait, you. Where must we be going? Where? Yeah. You went to. Oh! Okay, so there's a sniper up you. in there. Yeah. I think he fucking dodged it. Yeah, where am I supposed to be going? Of this thing? That thing? But it's electrified, so you need to break the, uh, the conductive boxes with the explosive barrels that are right next to them. Okay. That you're currently cuddling up to. You see? I shortcutted yeah. it. <laughs> I cheated. Yeah, you you did actually shortcut it, and there's nothing wrong with that. I did a little fucking speedrun skip. I, I didn't actually know about that prior. I just thought it might work, and it did. Yeah. So yeah, you avoided having to deal with a couple more snipers. Nice. I believe there's a hatch on the roof somewhere that you can climb inside. Or a hole or something. You're good at that, aren't you? Oh no, don't worry, you're never really stuck. For fuck's sake, jump further, Freeman, you fucking I... cock. You have to commit to it. Nope. Uh, there's something on this roof. You do need to be up here. So, just do a little exploring. There we go. That hole there. Now, be very careful. This section is about maneuvering. You're heading for the Lambda complex, aren't you? I was heading there myself until I wound up here. I lost my nerve. Take one look through that door and you'll see what I mean. I'm just going to wait out the catastrophe in here. If you intend to go on, then I beg of you. <laughs> is literally begging you not to get him killed. This is an area where if you set off one, the entire building goes up in smoke. And head crabs can also do that, so maybe deal with them before they start jumping. So yes. Even with objects that can be moved, it's unwise to move them if they have a trip uh, trip line on them or looking at them, because that will still set it off. I can't even get under that. I don't think I can, can I? Save it and see. Oh, yeah, I can. Oh, I can't even. Oh. Your goal is to try and get onto that central elevator in the middle of the room. Okay. Uh, actually, wait a minute. Oh, for fuck. Okay. I don't know how I didn't blow up then. That was kind of crazy. Oh, for fuck's sake, Freeman. You... Freeman! Crouch jumping, uh does allow you to hit jumps that are a bit further away. Yeah, that's, essentially... exactly, that's exactly what I've been doing this whole time, yeah. Pulling up your legs. Oh, I think you needed to do something with the electricity beforehand. But you have a save, so you can just reload it. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, I think something up in that main room. Sorry, it's been a while since I did this section. It's one of those things where I always did the main thing first, like like with that hatch, you know? Yeah. I always I always fixed the elevator before even trying to use it. You can crouch. Yeah. Yeah, I always fixed the elevator before trying to use it, so I forgot that we well, had to fix it. Didn't know that was gonna happen, did I, game? You can react fast enough to break that box if you see it coming. It has less health than other boxes. But am I done in here now? Or is that... I believe so, yeah. Pure! Or not. Uh... I never claimed to be a smart man. So, that takes you up to the top. There's got to be something around here that 
fixes the thing. Be careful. Yep. Yeah, there's something around here that fixes the elevator. I, I, I don't know whether me forgetting shit adds or takes away from the experience. Because <laughs> in a way, we're both solving the mystery. Yeah. Boxes that thing? don't have mines connected to them, you can break. Oh, that doesn't have a mine connected to it, you shitbag. That was technically uh, both of them. Okay, we haven't been this way yet, so oh, it's gotta be this yeah. way. Gotta be, gotta be, yeah. Right, no. Wait, yeah. What, not? What, um. No, uh, wait. No, this is the way you... En oh, sorry. <laughs> hey, you entered through that way, but you took a little... Uh, shortcut, so it didn't register, I'm I guess. I'm confused. What other ways are there to go? There isn't. There's, really. there's, there's that little dark alcove. This is this door, there? but there's nothing dark alcove. Where's that? Ah, yeah. uh, nothing in there. There's this door, but that door didn't open before. Uh, try it, I guess. Nah. I'm confused. Mm. Maybe it's this. Nope. Random, just like hinge trying sound from metal blast door. I do not know what I'm doing right now. It's okay, I've got you. I'll just look into it. God damn. I think once we've beaten this little uh, bit, this little challenge here, we'll leave it there for today. Okay, no. Oh my god. Uh, Boop, 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 boop. It says it says in the guide I'm looking at that it should work once you get onto it. But I don't think it's You know what? <laughs> Fuck it. God hates us, life is a lie, and the universe is ruled by lizard people. So Literally. elevator's not working. You know what? I'll fucking accept it at this Did point. The exact same thing as before. Ooh, hello. Nice. I've seen this. Now you get one of those you get one of those bug Vegans. thing that the enemies have been using. It does... It does shitty damage, but it just hunts them down. It regenerates over time. Yes, it also uh, it has eight shots that regenerate, so you don't need to find ammo for it. What the fuck are you doing, you stupid bastards? You accidentally hit him with the high pan before. So yeah, it's it's like a it's it's a secondary basically. It's not a gun that you're going to use for like full frontal, you know, full frontal combat nudity. Yeah. But anyhow, good enough. We're going to leave it there for today because it's about a two-hour session. So hope this you guys one enjoyed. was this was really good. We a little a lot bit of progress, more lost. I gotta say, we made a lot of progress. And the main issue, really, at the end of the day, was me getting say like having save points on low health. <laughs> that was really it. At the end of the day. But either way, we, we, we made a lot of progress today. I think we're about two-thirds of the way through the game at this point, aren't we? Probably like one on, one more session, maybe two more sessions, and we'll be done. Yeah. One or two more sessions, and we'll be done. We're oh, on yeah. uh, surface tension. There are, well, most of the way through it, so. three, there are three more chapters. Okay, nice one. Okay, yeah. So we might, we'll probably finish it next time, since Enjoy we made this. it through... Yeah, we made it through honor rail, apprehension, residue processing, questionable ethics, and we're almost through surface tension in one episode, so. Yeah, we should do it next time. But yeah, I've got to say, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you guys are looking forward to us finishing this game and getting on to Half-Life 2 as well. I've been enjoying Oh yeah, you suffering far. just makes it better, so. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.